Hey, what is up YouTube? Lou Boyer coming to you from, well, I'm coming to you from the Lake of the Ozarks in Missouri. This is Copperheads and Bikinis 3. I know there's going to be bikinis. I'm not sure about the Copperheads. I say that because I was here about a month ago. I did find some cool stuff, but no Copperheads. Will it be any different this trip? I don't know. We're sure going to have a go. Oh. Well, it's Copperheads bikinis. You gotta have bikinis in it. Yeah, but I was bent over in that shot. I don't know if well, I was. I'm gonna to cut eat. that part out. sort of a cloudy day today. I'm gonna walk along the shore here, see if I can't find something. Typically there'll be a water snake hanging out in one of these bushes or trees, but you never know. All right, so walking the shore and I have found my first water snake of the trip. And I'll see if I can get a little bit closer and better video. In fact, I'll probably get a paddle board and paddle over here and see if I can't get better video. All right, so I'm gonna use that thing to paddle out. It's an old windsurfer, but it works as a paddle board, although it is a little bit slippery. Got the beer, <laughs> got the main camera, which I'm trying to keep dry, and I got the GoPro uh, suction cup to the nose there. Now, I forgot the floaty for it, so if it comes undone, it's going to the bottom, which uh, it's like 50 feet deep here, so I'll never find it. Um, yeah, I got the shirt on just because there's a lot of mosquitoes. I've already gotten a few bites, and I don't want to get a lot more, but uh, let's see if we can't go find that snake, huh? All right, so just a little progress update here. I haven't spilt the beer, which is a, a good thing. The tree he's in is right there. I actually see him, and the house of ours is right here. So will I get better video by taking the paddleboard and coming all the way over here? Probably not, but it's kind of fun. Um, let's see what we can get before he drops into the water. All right, so I have found the snake, and not only have I found the snake, my wife sneaked up on me. Uh-huh. You want to come see the snake over here or what? Yeah, there's two of them. You passed one. Oh, no, he's here. Come check him out. I'm going to spin you around just so I can see you a little bit. Ah! Oh, what? my God. What? You hit Someone's the bottom? under my butt. <laughs> oh, it's the bottom. You're hitting the bottom. <laughs> oh, creeping me out. Okay. I don't see a snake. No snake? No. Right. I see it. You do? Yeah. Yeah. It's right there. Yeah, huh? It's a yep. Northern okay. banded water snake, or maybe it's just a banded water snake, or maybe a northern water snake, or yeah. maybe both. Kind of blends in with the branches, so you yeah. definitely have to you know, know what you're looking for, kind of. Exactly. And they sit like this, so in case something startles them, or they're, they're like in jeopardy of getting hurt or killed, they just drop right in the water and they're gone. Huh. Kind of cool. Yeah. Well, that's pretty cool. I'm literally right underneath him right now. Um, if he drops in, he's going to pretty much fall right on top of me. So there we go. Yeah, right above me, looking right down at me. He doesn't have a lot of options right now unless he falls right on top of me, which I don't think he'll do, although you never know. Yeah, I figure as soon as I start paddling away and he's in that tree right there, the sun started coming out. But uh, there's another one just up the way here, so let's see if we can find that one. So the next one that I saw from shore is just about another 100 meters up that way, which 
Doesn't sound like a lot, but I'm into the current and I'm into the wind. And I'm at risk of spilling the beer or losing my camera. Um, you can vote in the comments what you think would be worse. I'd say losing the camera, but uh, spilling your beer here in the Ozarks, I think is a, you know, a crime punishable by death. Anyway, we're almost there. So these snakes aren't gonna do a lot. They're just gonna sit there. So it doesn't make great video, it makes decent pictures. But uh, we're gonna leave this one be, and uh, what are we having for dinner? It's gonna be BLTs or burgers. BLTs or burgers, all right. Yes. Both sound good. Cool. <laughs> See you back at the dock. All right. All right, so pretty cool. You heard her, BLTs or what was the other one? I can't even remember anymore. Maybe it was hamburgers. I like hamburgers. Anyway, we're gonna leave this snake here. I'm gonna go eat. I might even add some of that in as some filler footage. And this is just day one, so the copperheads, maybe tonight. If not, I'm here for like, we're here for like four days, five days, something like that. We'll find one. Uh, so it's a great night. I know you can't smell it, but the grill smells amazing. Sun's going down over there. Gonna have some dinner here in a minute. And I'm in the company of snakes while uh, I'm out here on the dock. I don't know how well you can see it. And this I see every time I'm here for the most part. The water snakes will sit out there in the evenings. I don't know if they're sitting like that waiting for a fish to come by or what really the game plan is, but they're easy to spot with the white underbellies. All right, so it is day two. I'm in the house, actually. It rained quite a bit today. Um, I'm gonna go out and just see if that one water snake is here. It's actually in the tree right there. I don't know if I'll be able to see it from the house or not. It'd be cool if I could. Again, I don't even know if it's there. I see him in there, but it's just too hard to see him great with the camera from here. I'll probably walk down there and just uh, get a quick shot of him again. All right, so I'll just keep the camera rolling as I walk out the garage here. And it's this tree right in the corner. So let's, uh, maybe I didn't see a snake. I thought I did from above. I'm pretty sure I did, but let's check it for sure. So there he is. I don't have any bug spray on, so I'm not gonna take a lot of video, but uh, yeah, he's still hanging in the same tree. That's kind of cool. Hopefully I'll find a copperhead tonight. All right, so it's like day three on the lake here, guys. It's been beautiful. It's been cold and a bit rainy, though, in a few days. So um, the copperheads I usually find at night. We go road cruising when the roads are warm, and it just hasn't been warm. Now, today it's supposed to be like 85, and it's supposed to be 95 tomorrow when we leave. So tonight's my opportunity to try and find some copperheads for this video. All right, so I don't know my hawks or birds of prey that well, but uh, that thing's pretty badass looking. Um, I don't know if it's a red-tailed hawk. It, it looks like a sub-adult, whatever it is. Maybe it's a Cooper's hawk. Um, you guys can let me know in the comments, but uh, pretty badass looking bird. So we got the uh, we got the bikinis. We don't have any copperheads. We're we gonna go road cruise and find one tonight? I think so. Hey Vance, you think yeah. we'll go cruising for copperheads tonight? Cruising for copperheads? Yeah. It's a thing. <laughs> Actually walking out on the dock right now, I saw another water snake. Oh, he's right here. He's on the move here. I'll have to zoom in. I don't know if you'll still be able to see him. Yeah, there he is. So these water snakes are just everywhere around here. It's just a question of whether or not you can spot them or not. Another water snake at the lake. Cool. So here we go, this is a lifer for me. This is a speckled king snake. I've seen them at the property before, I just was never able to get video. And the ones I've seen were actually more yellow with black specks. This one's more black with yellow specks. But uh, what a sweet snake, I can't believe I sort of just stumbled across it. So I know this isn't the most natural <laughs> video in the world. But this is where I found him, down by the dock. and. Uh, 
I'm gonna let him go here in a minute try and get some better video. He may disappear real quickly, but um, what a beautiful snake. All right, so basically found him right on the dock here and that's where I'm gonna release him. We'll see where he goes. I'll put him down just right on here and let him go on his way. All right, so he eventually worked his way into some rocks that are right at the base of our bridge out to our dock. So that's where I found him essentially. That's where he is. Maybe I'll see him again. I don't know. That's going to probably do it for this video, guys. Copperheads and bikinis three minus the copperheads. Um, as always, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to, and uh, we'll see you. Good thing you didn't know the bee was on you. Might be on you, maybe not. Yeah. No. <laughs> uh huh.